baby don't check for me taking time out to be and live my life. so it is about 9 30 um right now i'm getting ready to go check my p.o box and then um, I need to go to the bank, then I need to go get a pedicure. My feet look terrible. Two of my nails broke on my toes, so it's just like, I've been riding around looking crazy, okay? But I haven't had time to go get a pedicure, so I'm gonna get a pedicure today and just run some errands. I'm gonna go to a few stores. I might go to Home Goods while I'm over here because I don't think the bank opens until 10 o'clock, if I'm not mistaken. I'm gonna go to Home Goods to kill a little bit of time. A lot of you guys have been asking me if, if I'm going to decorate for the fall, and I probably won't decorate for the fall. Um, yeah, I don't think I will. Cause I never really do too much anyway. I probably have maybe like one or two pumpkins on the side or something like that. And that's pretty much it. But I don't think I'm gonna do that this year. But y'all know this is my favorite time of the year. If you guys don't know, I am a Sagittarius. I love the cold weather. I hate the summertime. So I am not sad about it leaving at all, okay? <laughs> Cause I stay in the house most of the summertime anyway because I can't deal with the heat. So. Yeah, that's what I'm doing this morning. I was thinking about going to at home. Um, I still really haven't decided if I'm gonna go or not. I probably will, because I don't have um, much to do today. Um, but I definitely need to get my pedicure done and go to the bank, so. That's what I'm doing today. So I went to at home this morning. I did buy a few different vases. So I'll show you guys those when I get to the house. I wanted to try a new nail place. Oh, I should have went to Kirkland's. Oh, I'm gonna go to Kirkland's. That was an illegal term. Somebody just got their shipment in <laughs> at Cooper's Hawk, okay? Girl, let me mind my own business and let me drive this car. So yeah, so I'm going to see if I can find a new um, place for my pedicure. So it's this place in the town center. It's called, um, I think it's called Posh Nails. I'm not too sure, but um, I passed it when I was going to Hobby Lobby. So after I do my running around, cause I want to go to Kirkland's, I want to go to, um, is it Pottery Barn? I think I want to go. I'm going to go in Pottery Barn and just see, you know, what I can find. And then um, I'm going to go to this new nail place. And I'll let you guys know. Now, y'all know I'm not letting nobody touch my nails. No, I don't do that. But pedicures, I don't really mind going to different spots um, until I find that perfect one. So. I'm running in Kirkland's right now. I'm sitting outside. Here's Kirkland's. See if they have any fun home decor or fall decor. Um, Cause most of the time they do, they do have some cute little fall decor pieces. So I'm gonna go in here and see what I can find. And then I was thinking about going to Wasabi to get me some sushi. Um, because I want a double shrimp roll. And that's why I like to get my double shrimp rolls from is wasabi but then i was like well I, could, I need a salad i need to go home detox eat a salad y'all i'm just going through the motion okay i have my little shirt creative director that i got from ross i think it was like two weeks ago this is my first time wearing it but yeah let me go in here i'll catch up with y'all in a sec Spray paint it, so cute.
Okay, here's the place right next to the sushi burrito. So I'll let you guys know what I think. y'all so i'm getting ready to make myself a veggie pizza this is a margarita pizza from trader joe's sometimes i'll eat it like this so this time i'm gonna add vegetables to it i have my vegetables chopped up so this is how the pizza looks but again i am gonna put some vegetables on mine here's the vegetables so i have mushrooms bell pepper yellow pepper red pepper and onions and that's what I'm gonna use to put on the pizza. I might do some spinach as well, so. I'm too busy loving my friends. I ain't got no love to spare for you. I'm a big All right, y'all, so it is the next day, and I just came back from the gym with Ryan. We worked out together today, and then I stopped by the nail salon to get my nails done. I did a lighter color this time. It's just one number up. Y'all know I usually do 88 is DNC, 88 is a gel polish, and this time I did 87. So, it's cute, and I got my nails cut down a little bit, so I really like it. But right now, um, we're getting ready to run to Target. I'm gonna show you guys some of the pieces that I got yesterday, and then we're going to Target, so. So the first thing that I picked up was this piece here this is from home goods it's so cute so i grabbed this let me see how much it was um i want to say 25 yeah this was 24.99 it was made in portugal so yeah i thought that this was really nice and different you don't see it everywhere so i like that and then this is also from home goods this piece right here so i bought something to go on this shelf right here and i'm gonna take this out and put it in my studio this is what i found it's this nice little terracotta square vase i thought it was really cute this vase was $19.99 so I plan on spray painting this vase. Um, I'm thinking about doing like a chocolate brown. I don't think I'm gonna do um, a black. I know y'all was like, I know you're gonna spray paint it black, but I think I'm gonna do like a chocolate brown is what I'm looking for. So I'm gonna go look at some spray paints today. I've had a few people ask me the name of the spray paints that I use, so let me pull those out. This is the brand that I like to use. Rust-Oleum, um, I always get questions about the name of the spray paint that I use. Rust-Oleum, it's a really good brand. So yeah, we're gonna put this guy, he'll be like right here. I'm gonna move my record player so you guys can see how it would look. So this is how it would look. But like I said, just imagine it being a different color and it's gonna look really good, so yeah really cute y'all let me know if y'all want to see an updated living room tour so let me know in the comments 
my entertainment center is here. This thing was so heavy. It was at my front door. I told the guys to leave it at the front door because it was two guys and I don't know them like that. So I told them to leave it at the door and I tried to push this thing in by myself and I think I hurt my back a little bit because this thing is so heavy. This one right here will be replaced because y'all know I got this one from Ikea. Um, I'm replacing that one with this one so I'm really excited. Hopefully if Tony feel like it, he'll put it together tonight. If not, then I have to wait, so. But I really like the way this area looks. It looks really good. I can't wait to spray paint my new vase. The only thing is it's gonna take a little bit of time um, before I can spray paint it because y'all know before I would do it on my, my balcony, but now that I've done my balcony, I can't spray paint out there anymore because I'll mess something up, so <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, so let me just take this back. And I have a few more things to show y'all. So I bought some more lilies because these are going in my studio. And then I found this beautiful, okay, this marble tray. It's, oh, it's so pretty. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Like, oh my gosh. It's so heavy too. And I only paid $29.99 for it. This was made in India. It's so nice. I follow I follow this lady on um, Instagram and TikTok. I don't I forgot the name of her page. I want to say White Company, but it's not White Company. I know that for a fact because I tried to look up White Company and it didn't come up well it came up but it's not her but anyway she has this it's a marble it's like this but it's marble just like the tray that i just bought and it's a candle and the, it's 200 dollars. and i'm like oh my gosh it's so pretty and i'm like i do not want to spend 200 dollars on this candle but it's gorgeous i thought about it for a little bit but then i'm like i can't do it so <laughs> so i bought this because i'm going to put my some of my fall decor in here so I'm gonna show y'all what I'm gonna do really quick I still have to find the pumpkins but um, I'll show y'all a little something something I'm burning my favorite candle y'all I'm in love with these lilies they're just they're just everything but I'm burning one of my faves the white cypress y'all let me know if you guys tried it out smells so nice all right so this is I'm in my studio by the way <laughs> but um so these are my new lilies they're so pretty this is those of you that's new this is my picture that I did you can barely see it but it's a white um textured picture that I did for my studio it looks really good in person the colors are coming up a little weird but it's really really pretty um so here's my new lilies my son and my brother's getting ready to come over here to move a couch into the garage um because i took the couch that i had in here i took it out um and i need to move it to the garage this is my little cozy corner i have my throw on my chair just getting everything really cozy and ready. I got my windows open because I just put the flowers in here so they need a little sunlight. So the sun is definitely coming out. So yeah, okay. Now, I think I'm gonna move this. Well, I know I'm gonna move this. Let me move this out the way. Okay, so this is the plan. And these are real candles, by the way. You could still see like some, like some of the paper on the candles, but just try to ignore that. So I'm gonna do something really nice and simple like this. Um, and then I'll probably have like a pumpkin, some pumpkins on the side, and then maybe like some acorns, some cute little leaves, something nice, classy, and cute. Um, so yeah, that is the plan and it's gonna look so good. I'm gonna actually light these candles sometimes. So here's the scents that I got, the white citrus. It smells okay. Um, if you guys wanna look at the notes, 
smells okay. That's the the tall candles. For the shorter candles, I grabbed the white pumpkin by mistake. I really don't like that. Um, it's a little too sweet for me, but I can deal with it. So yeah, that is the scent that I got. And it's gonna look really cute. And that's probably all that I'll do. It's gonna be a cute little vibe with my little cozy corner. And then I need to get me like a little footstool cause this is where I basically record. Y'all excuse my curtains, they look a mess cause y'all know I have to have the curtains open for my flowers. But um, I need to get like a cute little footstool cause this is where I sit when I'm doing my sit down videos. I haven't filmed um, a sit down video in here in a while, but yeah, I think I'm going to get me a cute little footstool. And this is just going to be my little cute little cozy area. So I really like it. I'm going to do, I'm keeping it real simple this year. Well, I always keep it simple, but it's going to be really cute and simple. So love that. This color is so pretty. Yeah, it is. This is coming home with me. It smells so good. Yeah, so we're at Michael's to see what we can find. I'm just waiting on Ryan to get out of the car. And then we're gonna go inside. And after we leave Michael's, we're going to Target. You said what? Oh, what was you saying? How much are these? Forty percent off. I do like some. These might be kind of cute. See, I like this too because I like these little green leaves. But I don't know where this came from, so let me go around the other side. And let's look down here. Oh, remember I was telling y'all that I was thinking about getting some fake ones? These look real fake though, but look how expensive they are. $12.99. Like, girl. They're cute though. I love the real thing. The lilies just smells so amazing. <laughs> amazing. All right, let's see. What can we find? Let's see. Sunflowers are kind of cute. Oh, and for everybody that always asks me where I get my big glass from, this is where I get my glass. $25.99. There's like some little acorns. But I need something a little smaller. It's really big. See if I can find something. Mm -hmm. stuff, you know what I'm saying? Now these are so cute. I want these instead. Socks. And these are five. They're linen. Oh, I'm getting these, y'all. They're too cute. Oh, I love them. 
Oh, Ryan, Ryan too good to share a buggy with me. Like, what is this? Like, that's how we do. <laughs> yeah, look at this purse. Isn't this cute? I like this. They have another color, didn't they? Oh, they had the tan. Yeah, That's so cute. I like that. Okay, so we're at Starbucks and I'm going to do the iced apple crisp macchiato. We'll see. Okay, yeah, so we stopped by Crumble Cookies. Y'all know I'm not a sweets person, but I grabbed some. I think this one is like a pumpkin or something. This one is the waffle cookie, chocolate chip, and then we got three fruity pebbles. I did want to try one, but I didn't know that it was this thick. It's really thick. I thought it was just like just the top. So, um, yeah, Ryan and little Tony will be demolishing these and look y'all it come with like a little breakfast syrup that's so cute no get to the butter i know <laughs> that's too cute latona is gonna love this <laughs> all right y'all so y'all saw what i picked up already i picked up this it's like a little linen pumpkin so let's see if it's too big it probably is yeah that's a little too big but I'm still gonna keep them because they're just so adorable. And then I bought these. So my plan is to cut off the stick, of course. And I think these, yeah, these will fit better than the other ones. And I grabbed this, this right here. So I'm gonna cut the little small ones off. I bought some, how many of these? Oh yeah, I bought four of these. So I'll take, what I don't use, I'll just take back. And then I bought the acorns. So I'm gonna just set this up really quick. It'll be something really simple and easy and I'll show you guys how it looks when I'm done. Okay y'all, so here it is. This is my fall decor. Nice, classy, simple. And we love it. Now this candle right here acting real fake. Goodness. Do you love it? <laughs> back. All right, y'all, so I'm getting ready to end the video, but I did want to show you guys my manifestation journal that just came in the mail. Um, I'll have the link to this in the description box. I just thought it was really cool. Um, I think this was only like 10 bucks if I'm not mistaken, but let me show you guys how it looks in the inside. So, you know, it just has like your basic, this manifestation journal belongs to, it has a few meditations in here. And then it just has like the date, things you're grateful for, your affirmations for the day and things that you will manifest. Um, and what actions I feel inspired to take. I just thought that was so cool. And then, you know, right here, you just write down things that you're happy and grateful for. So yeah, I thought that this was really, really nice to have. So this is my little journal. Bye guys. Don't take it personal